we want you to saddle up because CBS News Texas, we are heading south. We are getting you ready for all things CMT in Austin this week. We, uh, we like us some country music around here. Oh, yeah. So it's not just an award show without the glitz and the glam, of course, of the red carpet. Our Nicole Nielsen taking a closer look at the fashion we can expect to see at this year's CMT Awards. Trends may come and go. A classic pair of boots can take you absolutely anywhere. But the staples of Western fashion have stayed timeless over the years. A trusty pair of boots, jeans, and a good old-fashioned cowboy hat. It's the few items that, no matter the decade, you'll see gracing the CMT Music Awards red carpet alongside designer gowns and suits. I really love the red ones with the state of Texas on them. I think that those are a perfect statement piece. I would wear those myself. Maggie Terry is a fashion enthusiast and works at the National Cowgirl Museum and Hall of Fame in Fort Worth. She says Western fashion has seemingly transcended time because of its deep roots in American culture. I think there's a little bit of nostalgia that goes with the Western industry. With many country artists originating from small rural parts of the country, growing up on ranches or in farming communities, they've continued to show their pride for their hometowns with what they wear. And so while you won't see an outfit like this one on the red carpet, there are aspects like the fringe that never go out of style. And texture and shape. The timeless Western wear pieces are often as different in their style as they are in their owner. Like Lainey Wilson, who has found her way modernizing bell bottoms as her signature look. She has been a big part in bringing back the bell bottom trend and really making it her own. Terry says she wouldn't be surprised to see those back on the red carpet this year, along with darker and moodier looks inspired by celebrities like Beyonce and Bella Hadid, who have recently embraced Western wear. The Johnny Cash man in black trend is very big right now. It was very big at national finals rodeo this past year, and I'm very interested in seeing some of that in on the red carpet this year. So for now, we'll wait and see. Infowort Nicole Nielsen, CBS News, Texas.